I graduated from Oklahoma State University. I have my bachelor's in Spanish. I am bilingual. And I thought, man, that'll take me far because everybody can use Spanish. I worked at an insurance company for 14 years. Every time we would get an extra bonus check, we would go do something special with the family and, and things like that. I thought that's where I was going to retire from. Two years ago, they'd closed down the office. I lost my job. My husband works. He's a roofer. When I first lost my job, it just happened to be, it was in October. And so it was coming upon a slow time of year for him. So we struggled a lot through that time. It got to points where, you know, we, I would open the refrigerator and there wouldn't be a lot in there. Well, I experienced a lot of guilt. Um, my kids are my world. They're everything to me. And just thinking that I may not be able to put food on the table or I may not be able to pay for my car payment. How am I gonna get them to school? There were times that I would go to bed at night and just cry myself to sleep because I didn't know how am I gonna pay for things. I first came into contact with Our Daily Bread when a friend of mine had asked me to go with her. I had gone to translate. The volunteer asked me if I needed services as well. Um, it kind of hit me. That was the first time I was like, I really do. As we were going through our daily bread, you know, it felt like it was in a grocery store. And I got to choose the things that my family would eat. I had dignity. The face of hunger is very different than what we may assume it is. You realize it could be you at any point. Her story is not unique. There are lots like her, where we serve a lot of guests who have education, who have a degree, who have great jobs. Life happens, and then they find themselves in a situation where they need help. But I think there's families that just need it to help them get through a phase. You know, I'm so thankful for people that have given back. When you've lived through that, you see the impact that food has. It seems so minor, but it's so important. <laughs>